just something you said there of just if there is a, a question that you're asking yourself, it is how can you be of of service? Uh, could you kind of give me a, a sense of how that that experience for you in life has evolved? Yeah, again, this is so in my active alcoholism or active addiction, I'm not a great fan of labels. So yeah. addiction, alcoholism, whatever you want to call it, a drink problem, whatever. But in that past, I was a very selfish person, selfish the, selfish to a point where that I can look at it now and it's actually quite scary how devious and manipulative I, I was to get what I wanted without any thought for anyone else around me. So now I live almost a polar opposite way of life. And one of the first things I have to do every day, rather than see what I can do for me, is see what I can do for other people. And, you know, altruism runs through my recovery. It's, we could open up a whole new conversation about whether true altruism actually exists because I gain a lot from altruism. So is it actually altruism? Um, well, that's perhaps another conversation for another day. So by helping others, I'm helping myself. By helping other alcoholics, I'm helping myself. I spend at least one day a week helping my parents who are getting on a bit now and I go and do odd jobs around their house to almost make up a bit for, for the trouble that I've put them through in the past. Um, the Release Mates Project, which I run, I relate to prison leavers getting out of prison, not having a chance in life. So I go back to prisons and I try and create those chances. And that's vital to me. That's vital to me. And not only do I seek guidance from a higher power or spirit in the morning about what to do, but when I go to bed at night time, I also do a little appraisal of that. Have I been honest? Have I helped other people? Are the times when someone's asked me to do something and it seemed like a bit of an effort to do it. You know, if someone asked me for a lift to an AA meeting at half eight at night and I want to watch Coronation Street instead. You know, it's little things like that that I, I really need to be honest and, and pretty tough on myself about. Um, but the benefits are, you know, a wonderful life, a wonderful life. And I don't think, I don't think as a human there's much better feeling than giving someone your own time and support 